Hey guys, welcome back to the Drum Become Blog channel. I know I haven't posted anything on this channel for a little while, and I hate to be doing this, but I really kind of need your guys' feedback as soon as possible. At the time of this filming, there's 59 hours left in order to put money down on the Ouya Kickstarter. If you guys don't know much about it, I kind of did a news spoof about it over here. And so why am I on the fence about this? Well, I've been wanting to do some Android development. Uh, for some homegrown stuff, it really wasn't to to sell it to anyone, but really to do some things for myself, uh, for my some applications I'd like to see for my phone that just don't exist out in the uh, the Google Play market area, and this seemed like a pretty inexpensive way to just jump in, uh, but with the Google Nexus 7 on the horizon uh, so that I can actually do the testing as though it's a true tablet as opposed to being a console I just don't know if it makes sense uh, Ouya has made a killing on Kickstarter but unfortunately the Kickstarter um, likelihood that stuff that gets funded for electronics actually succeeds is only hovering it around um, from from articles that I've read has is only hovering around 30% so you know unfortunately with the the beauty of Kickstarter is that if you have an idea and you want to get it funded you can go there and without acquiring a loan you can um, try to garner some support the the flip side the negative side of Kickstarter of course is that there is no there is no protection for the people who actually supply money for Kickstarter so if uh, this Ouya, for instance, collects all this money and then doesn't actually, they don't actually make any of the Ouyas. If you supported it, you're SOL. And um, so I'd love to get your guys' feedback on it. I, I think it's a, I think it's a great conceptual idea. And since I'm not trying to make money making a particular app, um, it seems like it would be a great little way to to kind of get in right away. And, and start developing for something. But again, I'm just on the fence and I just don't know if it's worth gambling the 99 bucks or if it's time to just, you know, delay a little bit, pick up the Google Nexus 7 when it comes out and um, see where it goes from there. Please leave your comments down below. I'd love to get some insight into this, and I uh, hope you guys are having a good one. More videos will be coming on, out on this channel as well as on the other two channels, Dermacom and Six Sided Films. Have a good one. Bye.